Splash was founded in uh, 1990 by Joanne Grover, what we'd like to call the power of one. It was an individual who looked around and saw that the area around Freeport, particularly the canals, were very dirty after a weekend, and she decided single-handedly to get in her boat and clean it up. Splash is basically an environmental organization. Uh, even though we take care of the bay, we're interested in in every form of environmental issues that we can come across. We want to keep this earth as clean as we found it, maybe even better. The members of Splash are made up of all volunteers. There's not one paid member, and we are about 2,500 members right now. We go out on a daily basis uh, with our fellow members, and we pick up whatever trash we can. pretty intense once you get in there. You can get on your hands and knees and just like not move from a spot for an hour. Just finding everything from styrofoam, coolers, oil cans, plastic bottles, water bottles, and everything right down to a cigarette butt that goes out the window. If it makes its way into the storm drain, it's gonna make its way into the bay. The physical aspect of retrieving garbage and, and trying to get a handle on the pollution is done with a fleet of boats. There's plenty of available captains. Some boats have two or three captains so that we can get the boats out there, you know, every day. A lot of the trash that really is on the surface is um, basically uh, just accumulates out there. You can't keep up with it. When we, when we close and we bring our boats in at the end of the year, that first spring cleanup for those months over the winter that we weren't out there, it was like we were never even out there. We recently hit a million pounds of garbage. It's a significant figure, but we're still scratching the surface because even though we've gotten that much, uh, this there's much more out to, to be picked up. One person 20 years ago took it upon herself to take this project on. It's all about the power of one. Think about all the things that you consume. What's your own personal garbage stream? Splash is really the only organization uh, I believe that really have the heart to do something for the environment. Because somebody doesn't bother to throw something, recycle it, or, or dispose of it properly, we're out there covering thousands of acres, trying to find this stuff and pull it out by hand. There's a lot of young people, young generation, that are actually looking at all this out there and are starting to give us a good hand in picking it up.